These iron wheel drills have been no joke. And to be honest, the last two, I didn't make it. <laughs> I didn't hit the rep goal. So uh, something to shoot for. Hey everybody, I wanna do a quick um, week one of month two roundup because it has been uh, a little bit of time. And so this week consisted of four workouts. Your, I'm gonna read it. Upper push, lower posterior 1A, upper pull, lower anterior 1A. Then you take a rest day, you go on upper push, lower posterior 2A, upper pull, lower anterior 2A. Then it's a rest day. And then you do something called the pro day preparation. Um, which I'm gonna to get to today. That is simply taking some primer corrective moves, putting those into a circuit, and then you do a very minimal cardio workout. And basically, it's kind of interesting, it's the last workout of the week, but it's a prep day for the next week's workouts. Um, also, as you can, it, you know, it took me a while, I think, what am I on, like day 12 since my last video, um, to get through this week because I broke the workouts up. And like I said, that worked out for me because I also, I also fit in um, some core on my own as well as my own cardio. In fact, one day I did Insanity. So um, as I've said before, the weeks, you know, my, my one week is going to span probably not this long because this week I we were still on Christmas winter break from school so you know kids are home it's just not that easy to disappear down here for like an hour and a half but that being said um I'm enjoying month two thus far I'm enjoying the ability to split these up when you just need a small workout not a very intense long workout and incorporating some of the other stuff that I prefer to incorporate. Um, and the intensity level has significantly increased for um, at least for some of the new concepts that have been incorporated. One workout consists of two heavy lifts two primers, um, those iron wheel drills, which have stepped up in intensity tremendously, and it's called a triple, triple, double. So here's what a workout would look like. We have a primer, heavy lift, and those heavy lifts are broken up into um, three, I'm gonna call them sets, but there's sets within the sets. Um, you have a very, you start out with, um, very minimal rep with a heavier weight and he gives you your calculations. He calls this like a neurological, um, stimulus. I guess it's supposed to help you lift even heavier, but then you drop it down to what he calls your working weight, which is your three by fives. And then you'll cut that weight again to speed it up. Then after that, you'll go on to your second heavy lift that follows the same format primer, heavy lift. Then you finish the workouts and depending on the day, the iron wheel drill will come before or at the end. You'll have an iron wheel drill, which um, as I said before, those have stepped up in intensity that he's added a minute on to those. And then you have what's called the triple, triple, double, which took me a little bit to kind of get familiar with. What it is, it's called triple triple but to me it's six exercises and within those ex those six exercises he's got them broken into two um, circuits basically so the first set of three you'll use the same weight and then the second set of three if you need to up or lower that weight you'll use that same weight throughout those three exercises so triple three exercises triple three exercises double so two of them stacked together and then it is a 
10 straight minutes of as many sets as you can complete. And that is intense. Um, especially, especially one of the leg days. One of the leg days, it's a lot of lunges. down way worse than the iron wheel drill i know the next day i was sore after all of that lunging but um again if you are doing the entire workout it is probably a good 90 minutes if you split them up like i did they were taking about 30 minutes um, just because of how significant those rest periods can be especially on those heavy lifts um, you are advised that if you cannot complete your three by five like too heavy you get three and a half four and you can't complete anymore that you are supposed to take five minute rest so obviously when you're you know anywhere from you know two four maybe five minutes of rest between those sets that adds time um, but that's it's all all she wrote for week one of month two as i become more aware of things understand things more i will pass that information along so um happy new year everybody hope the new year is starting out well for you I know we are officially getting back to like normal in this house and that just feels amazing. See you next week.